6am in the morning the gate of the camp just opened and we are on the road and the first animal crossed already the road now it's, it's a, a wild beast wild beast yeah right <laughs> but the car is stopping so let's see what we find around satara camp You spot her? <laughs> surrounded by giraffes all around us they have their breakfast and pick the leaves of the trees it's so cute African roadblock. <laughs> Intensive rains and flooding in February this year, there still was a lot of water in this part of the park.
needed a bathroom break and the only possibility was this Vanetsi parking. And it turns out to be a picnic spot with an amazing view over the Krüger because you can walk up a hill. It's open so wildlife can enter, but it's really beautiful. Look! Like it? Stunning view. He's still tired. <laughs> Where we sit now is right on the border to Mozambique. So we drove all the way to this corner. And yeah, it's nice. The views are amazing. Animals we don't see at the moment, but they will come again. We spotted a small crocodile outside, right there. Let me show you, it must be here. And here in the river, crocodile is swimming. It's hard to tell, it's about <sighs> here. <laughs> This river is so beautiful, but infested with crocodiles and some beautiful birds. So, after this amazing crocodile sighting, this bird is loud, uh, we are at the Sweeney height and we will, we are alone, which is amazing. So we will quickly walk down and see what we can find. And I have to hurry up, otherwise you never know if there's a lion in the bush. Okay. 
here is our parking with our bit dusty car and here is our cute little hut again we have an outdoor kitchen and here before there was the fridge but now they use it as a storage because there are some monkeys here so you can put in your food there and Satara camp is organized that all the huts they go in different circles and the circles are great because it offers you a lot of privacy and it's quite cute and here's the room it's really basic but it was super clean two beds the window a sink and the bathroom to be honest we have expected it to be worse like really not comfortable but it's quite nice also in the kitchen you have everything all the utensils and they are clean and it's well kept although it's really old but yeah we have a pleasant stay so after working at midday today in the camp and making a bit of a break washing some clothes we are now in the car again for the afternoon drive it's 2 p.m and yeah, we start now from Satara Rest Camp in the direction of Orpen Rest Camp and do a loop around the north of this part. Hopefully, of course, to find some big cats. So far, one tortoise, but a beautiful one. <laughs> so have a look. Yes. And the weather is looks a bit rainy in front of us, so we will see. Maybe we find wet cats. I don't know, so be surprised. Today is giraffe day. Everywhere we go, we only find giraffes, which is pretty cool. <laughs> Excuse me, sir. Can we pass? No? Okay, we wait.
Now we are a bit north of Timbavati at the Rattle Pan height and some elephants are drinking. There's another crocodile here. Ah, oh, the elephant is splashing there. And in the distance you can sometimes even hear the hippos. That is a huge herd of buffaloes, but huge, amazing. Today was a quiet day around Satara, no cats, but we had some pretty nice sightings of giraffes and elephants. This can happen in the Kruger, I mean the animals roam around, but we enjoyed the day. So subscribe to our channel for more adventures from the Kruger National Park. But right in front of camp, we were surprised by this jackal.